I much like what Hanukkah had to say. Waylon Yutani ran Katanga like a fucking ant farm. Used androids to bring up animals from the moon, left them on the refinery for the Xenos, took the eggs back down to the lab. There's a queen aboard Katanga, laying those eggs. SOP says, Phew, that's when you pull out a final insurance claim. We'll deal with Katanga later. Right now, Colonel Ship wants us down on LV-895. Hanukkah says some Whaling Yutani people disappeared before his group evac. Could be there's other survivors looking for rescue. You could get the details on the surface conditions from Lieutenant Ko. She'll be flying you and Herrera down. Busy. Shoo. Our landing zone's a couple of clicks from Pala Station, at the base of the mountains to the west. You won't need any special gear, the environment is close enough to Earth. There's native life, but you probably won't have to worry about it. The Xenos that Honaker's idiot employers let loose are a bigger threat. Only rumors leaking out of Honaker's debrief. Something about big, color-changing cats. According to Whalen yutanis officially filed survey data, we're orbiting a barren rock. No life. Prebiotic Atmo. You can look out a porthole and see that's wrong. Or a lie. A shirt sleeves habitable world, no terraforming needed. Low investment, high return. Maybe they didn't declare it to avoid competition. Well, around Pala Station, the air's about Earth normal. Pressure 908 millibars. Little heavier on CO2. No obvious toxins or allergens. Take the regulation antihistamines anyway. If you end up climbing a mountain, you'll have a problem. Low-lying areas have thick atmo, but it attenuates fast. A lot like Mars after we terraformed it. Gravity is 0.92. That's... odd. But it means you won't notice any difference from shipboard artificial grav. Pala's the source of the Xeno outbreak? I had enough bugs on my canopy in Katanga's hangar, thanks. Can't believe Herrera wouldn't let me fire missiles. You'd have ducked. Esther says there's tunnels in the mountains near our LZ. Colonel Ship thinks it's the direction any survivors would run, and the Commissars agree with her. Well, around Pala Station, the air's about Earth normal. Pressure 908 millibar. If you end up climbing a mountain, you'll have a problem. Just remember, Wayland managers tend to store profit margins and... Regulation cornbread contains... Yeah, damn right you're ready for another mission. We're heading down to LV-895. The Weyland yutani surface lab was overrun by Xenos, but there may be survivors. The closest shelter is the mountain caves to the west. You repel into the caverns for search and rescue. Check your fire. Remember, we're looking for friendlies. This isn't a cave. It's block construction. A company bunker, maybe.
still spread this far from Hala Station, they'll be after any survivors. Get moving. A lot of Wayland shit down here. Some kind of auxiliary base? Fallback position? Sentry deployed. Terminal. See if you can pull any logs. Security log. Free range experiments have it penetrated was. air shafts. Uh, keep moving. alive.
casualties. Sounds like they got drones loose in here. This is the Colonial Marines. You from Pala Station? Yes. I'm Security Chief Cynthia Rodriguez. You're in danger here, Marines. Yeah, no kidding. We're here to rescue you. survivors. Our position is secure. I recommend you withdraw. Understood, ma'am. Be ready to receive us. Got another drone creeping on you.
Staplers, Rodriguez. Give me time to contact the home office for guidance. What the hell's her problem? Does she even want to be rescued? Bunker. Damn. Oh, but 
2.6. Fire team, secure an LZ so we can pick you up later. Sentry deployed. Eyes on the warrior. Rodriguez is ahead. Let's figure out what we're getting into. <laughs> 